Spike. It's just Pinkie Pie, Rarity, and Applejack are getting back from their Seaward Shoals boat trip, and I can't wait to hear all about it. Bouncy, excited Princess Twilight is best Princess Twilight. So, how was the trip? I think it went well. Sorry I can't make the tea party today, but there's a small problem with the guest list. Plus, I'm right in the middle of a very important cupcake. Thank you. Well, I guess someone's number came up. You thought you were finally safe, but I brought it back. <gasps> I'm sorry, but my mane wasn't made to support marine life. Darling, it's better down where it's wetter. Oh, giga dee. <laughs> She's fluffy. Oh, I'm so sorry. I had no idea you had such distaste for cucumbers. Yar, har, 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 hearty, har, har, har. Is this how Rarity sees Applejack? It would explain a lot. I thought I overpacked until I saw Rarity and her team of quarter ponies. <laughs> Prepare yourselves for a luxury cruise. A day of opulence, decadence, and extravagance. Okay, this is just silly. Rarity doesn't have a crew. She has a surprisingly jacked up little sister. Well, despite your point of view, I can thrill a girl or two. But I'd rather get it on with you. Ha, ha, ha. And cue the Titanic theme. I said cue the Titanic theme. Oh, that's right, it's copyrighted. But they had other ideas. La, la, la. This is how Applejack sees Rarity, all dolled up and excited for whatever she has planned. Aww. Oh, darling, that food isn't fit for a pony of proper breeding, darling, and refinement, darling. Proper breeding? You mean Twilight? Actually, she's Canterlot nobility, so she's probably inbred like a motherfucker. If they all blame each other, I don't know how we're gonna get them to talk again. Neither do I, Spike. Neither do I. There's cucumber sandwiches in each story. Maybe you can blame it on a sea monster. Aha! Not only do I think I know how the boat sank, I have a pretty good idea how to get Rarity, Applejack, and Pinkie Pie back together. Twilight, do you really have to ship right now? Well, maybe it wasn't the middle of the ocean. <sighs> Even so, I don't appreciate being hornswoggled into coming back here. Hornswoggle? Cucumber just happens to be the favorite food of the trihorn bunyip. And bubbles, followed by a swell, is what happens when they swim up to the shallows from deep water. So, we attracted a trihorn, whatchamacallit? With cucumber sandwiches. Sounds like a stretch. Hello, bunyip, sir. <laughs> oh my god! That was a joke! I was making a joke, and you actually went ahead and did that? Oh, and we were doing so well, too. Wait a minute. You brought all those games and things for us? Of course! I figured the boat trip was the perfect time to do things that were silly and fun! And I was just trying to give the two of you the elegant cruise I thought you deserved. And I just wanted to give you two a high seas adventure, since that'd be something new and different for y'all. It seems to be the season of learning to open your fucking mouths for once. Rarity, that's been in the ocean. There's nothing like a luxurious adventure boat party to get you out of your element. Yay, you can stop writing and have ice cream like a normal kid. Three cheers for a kind mistress. Is that another dirty joke? What? 
No! Spike's a child, Billy! What's wrong with you? My god. Beep. Beep. Beep.